Well, good afternoon. Good afternoon. We're all ready for the new season. How ready are you and Manchester City? Well, absolutely ready. I think we made a very good precision. We are working for about 40 days with all the players, seeing, knowing each other more. And uh, I think we're in a very good shape to start the, the Premier League. Some of those players have said it was the hardest pre-season they've had. How, how pleased are you a, to hear that and, and with pre-season? I didn't hear about that. <laughs> were you, were you yeah, pleased with how I, it went? I, I Pardon? Were you pleased with how it went in terms of... Yes, yes, for me, yes, because we had a programme for the whole pre, for the whole pre-season. Each week we made all the work we, we need every week. We played seven friendly matches, so making a different start at 11, so most of them had and an average of minutes very similar, so we have the whole squad now to, to choose the, the, the starter start for, for Newcastle ne next Monday. You did your transfer business quickly and early. How pleased have you been with them settling in the four players you brought in? Very pleased. I think we have a uh, squad uh, we need for, for the year. We had an uh, important competition, and not only the Premier League and also Champions League, so we have the, the squad we, we need. What are the chances of you adding to that squad before the end of the month now? What the chance of what? Of you adding to that squad, buy, buying a player, another player or another... We have different players, as, 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 as Navas. I think we have a, another striker as, as, uh, as Negredo. We, we try to complete what we, we thought what we will need the, the whole year. Do you, think, do you think then you'll do any other business or are you saying no more, no more? We'll see, we'll see. We we can we can we, we don't uh, need to finish today, so we, maybe not, but uh, maybe yes also. And what's the situation with Scott Sinclair? Scott Sinclair is here in the, in the squad. He wants to play more. Maybe he in this squad he has important players in that play in his same position. Uh, we will see what happens with him from today or, or tomorrow. But if he wants to go in loan to play more. We will try to to give him, but if all, only if he if he agreed. I think we were surprised to see Matija Mustasic training today. How pleased are you, and how surprised are you that he's reacted so so well from his ankle? Uh, surprised not because uh, we we saw him working hardly the the last week. He's not uh, ready for for the next match, but I think the next week he will work normally with the whole squad. And how many teams do you think? can win this Premier League this season, that one? 20 teams. 20 teams? Always, always. You must, you must be sure that 20 teams can, can, uh, can win the, 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 the Premier League. Then uh, every week we will see which teams are stronger than the other. But uh, I think for me, the, the way I, I think, nobody, or all, all of them can, can win it. But who do you think your main rivals will be then? Well, normally the same uh, clubs that every year are trying to, to win the, the, the Champions League. Uh, Manchester United, uh, the new, uh, Chelsea, Arsenal, Liverpool, Tottenham, all of them are important. But always, I think every year, you have a surprise. In, uh, uh, always a club has a surprise. And so maybe another could do it also this year. Before you came into this job, how much of the Premier League did you watch? Is it something that you're very familiar with? Absolutely. I worked nine years before here in Europe and I absolutely uh, seen every weekend a lot of match of Premier League. I played four Champions Leagues against uh, English Premier team. So I know all I, all I, all I know about that and, and I'm living here, of course, a lot of more information. Do you still have that same excitement that you had from the first day in your first job? Yes, absolutely, absolutely. I'm more than than it's the, um, my first time here in England. It's, 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 a, it's a different league, more difficult or less difficult. We'll see what happened during the year, but for me, exactly the same. And how are you finding life here now as well? We, we have a bit more rain than perhaps you used to. It's different. It's different. That's In terms of Newcastle, do you know now your best or your favoured starting eleven? We'll see tomorrow. Not yet because yesterday arrived all the players, all the players that played for their national squad in the middle of the week. So we'll see tomorrow. But I had 
not 100 percent, but sure they they don't say they even start. Yes. And just finally, for me, do you have to go into the start of a season with confidence that by the end of the year that Manchester City will be top of the Premier League? Of course, of course, we have a, a lot of hopeless, hopeless of, of, of the of the whole season. We know we have a strong squad. Other teams also have a strong. Uh, other clubs also have a st strong team, a strong squad. But uh, I'm sure that we are going to have a very successful season. Um, now we we must demonstrate it every every weekend. Um, well, have you been pleased? You mentioned that pre-season has gone well, but there hasn't been too much attention on you and Manchester City. There have been other transfer sagas at other clubs that seem to dominate. Has that been pleasing for you that you've been allowed to just get on with your job of settling in here? Yes, I'm very pleased. That's why we, we did it the way the way we we thought that was, uh, that was the, the best thing the best thing for for us. Uh, we are all settled and, and in what we need uh, for players for this year. So so we're very pleased about that. I'm very strong going into it. You mentioned you don't know about new transfers, but you've had a look at obviously your squad now. You'll have an idea of your players. Are you happy knowing that what you have now is strong enough as it is now for? the Premier League title? Yes, I, I suppose, yes, of course. And it's been a, an international week, of course, and so many of your players have been away. Uh, Joe Hart's your, your keeper. He's had a tricky week. Things didn't maybe go as well for him for England. Have you spoken to him? Have you talked to him about that game, about his season ahead? No, I haven't spoken with him uh, maybe tomorrow. We, we, but I think uh, that Joe Hart uh, has to to demonstrate why he's the best goalkeeper of England every week he plays. I think he's a very important goalkeeper. I have a lot of trust on him. Everyone can make an hero in one match, but personally I have a lot of trust in Joe Hart, so I don't have any problem for his performance. And I am sure he will, again this year, he will demonstrate why he's the number one in England. And finally, at Malaga, your formation tended to be uh, four four two or maybe a four two three one with the Premier League. Have you have you looked at that and maybe decided to change things or will you stick to that kind of formation? What can we expect? No, I'm very flexible in that, in that in that sense. So I don't have an ex I don't have to play every week the, exactly the same. I have a a, a way I I, I like how how the my team must must play. But uh, we will we will see it uh, for a lot of reasons which is the which is the best one. But uh, I don't afraid uh, of playing different ways because the the team is prepared to do it. Manuel, how is Sergio Aguero? Fine, no problem. He worked with us uh, normally for the last ten days, so he's not a, he have no, no problem for us. So he could be playing on Monday. Maybe yes. Yes. Good. Have you decided on your your front two or your main striker? Because obviously the four strikers, there's quite a lot of competition there. Do you know in your head who your favoured striker striker is? Today? We have four important strikers, that's why they are here in this squad. Huh? But we have four strikers uh, for, the whole, for the whole year, for the whole season. I'm not uh, worried about who's, who will play tomorrow ne or next, uh, next Monday or next, or next Sunday. I have four strikers because I think we need four strikers for the, for the whole week. And we will see each week which are the best of them for, for each match. How much of an advantage do you think? Having your squad settled for 40 days and your other title rivals still lots of speculation about all their best players. How much of an advantage is it that you've got your, your squad settled now? Nobody knows that. <laughs> the, for me, it was the best thing to, to do. That's why I spoke with Chiki at the beginning to try to hard settle the squad. Uh, the, uh, for the from the first moment, I don't know what happened with the other class, but we'll see next Monday. It was <laughs> next Monday, eight o'clock. We we'll see if it was a, a good uh, decision.